Before we get into the editing, I want to give a huge thank you to the sponsor of today's video, which is Storyblocks. Storyblocks is a stock media subscription service that offers a vast array of stock audio, images, videos, and sound effects. They offer unlimited downloads for a very diverse and high quality range of media for only one subscription cost. There's over 1 million pieces of 4K and HD footage, templates, music, sound effects, images, and more. It's refreshed and updated consistently with commissioned content based directly on on consumer preferences and demands. My personal favorite thing about Storyblocks is that it keeps you legally covered with very clear-cut licensing. Obviously, as an editor and YouTuber, it's very important for me to have access to royalty-free assets. For example, the background music that you're hearing in this video, that has to be royalty-free. Lastly, and maybe most importantly, Storyblocks is super simple to navigate and use. There's even a Storyblocks plugin for Creative Cloud, so you can access the entire stock library directly through programs like After Effects and Premiere Pro. To get started with with unlimited stock media downloads at one set price, you can check out my personalized Storyblocks link in the description. All right, guys, let's get into the video. Hey guys, it's Lauren. Right off the bat, here are all of my socials and you should go follow them if you don't already. I need to fill you in on some of the Lauren lore so you guys can understand where I've been. So I ended school a couple weeks ago, so I had to deal with like finals and all that stuff. But then soon after I came home, I sat down to film this exact video. Then I opened my computer and tell me why it just didn't turn on. I will probably be getting my computer back in like four or five days, but I haven't had it since May 24th and today is June 7th. Do the math. My entire personality is editing. If you take that away, what am I? So now you might be wondering, Lauren, what is this video gonna be about if you don't have your computer to edit? Well, my friends over at Video Star are so, so sweet. I told them about my situation and they sent me like a free pass for the Video Star Pro. And for this video, I'm gonna be editing my hype and concert footage while also showing you some of the vlog footage that I recorded while I was there. And if you saw my other socials, I also did meet TXT. I can't. The fact that that's something I can actually say and that's a true statement still doesn't feel real to me, but that's a whole other event story time video of its own. So, so once I get my computer back, you guys can definitely look forward to another video where I'll be editing my TXT pictures and talking about that experience. And also one last thing, if I sound a little bit weird and stuffy, it's because I have COVID. Yes, I have COVID in 2024. A lot of people are like, it still exists. All right, enough said, let's get into the video. Okay, here she is in all her glory. So what we're gonna do first is import the audio, plus sign, square. We're gonna be using a part of the song TKO by Justin Timberlake. I'll also have you guys know I FaceTimed my best friend Nav before this because she's a video star pro. I'll have her out on the screen. And she taught me how to cut the beats and then add the videos to the beats. You just have to like move it forward very, yeah, like by individual frames and then you set, keep going, set. I think that's it, okay. Right there, set. Frick, no, one back. Oh, these beats are like, they are close next to each other, okay. Set, oh guys, I don't know about this. If it's off beat, no it isn't. I wanna restart this. Edit, split scene. I need to do this so precisely, concisely. Set, no, it's such a tiny beat, bruh. Immediately, no, let's try it again. <laughs> ah! I have an idea. Hold on. I'll be back to show you guys. I look ugly though. So <laughs> what now? Hey guys, it's Lauren. Today I'm going to be vlogging my day at the Enhype and Fate Plus concert at UBS Arena. The lighting right now is not giving, but here's my makeup. I don't know if you can tell, but the fit is inspired by He Song's Sweet Venom outfit in the music video. <laughs> Yeehaw. <laughs> No, no, no. <laughs> I, if I was in a K-pop group, I would be the visual hole. <laughs> <laughs> I would be the least biased member. No one's buying my photo cards. Guys, we're in the car. Say hi. Hi. Beautiful view. Beautiful view of the New York traffic. <laughs> Love of my heart. I'm sorry, I can't speak Korean like some people. So guys, what songs are we most excited? I will say I'm most excited for Paradox and One in a Billion. What are you most excited for? For Shout Out and... Let me in, let me in, let me in. Let me in 20Q? 20 Cube. No! No, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. She does not like that song. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. What are you most excited for? I'm Maybe. most excited for... Pass the mic! Hey, 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 hey
it. I think I'm definitely gonna get clowned for this, but like I completely understand guys, it's okay. So I went into the TikTok editor and I just added the heart emoji for every beat. So red and then blue and then red and then blue. So then I'm gonna use that to mark the beats. So we'll go forward until we see the blue. Just keep tapping, set. Oh, also whenever I'm sick and I have a voice like this, people tell me I sound like Jojo Siwa. Um, does that hurt my heart and soul? Well, yes. Listen, I'm a strong soldier. I can take it. I don't even know if I have enough clips. <laughs> okay, we will see. We're almost done. Okay, that was the last beat. Cool, so let's split. Okay, done. And now what I do is go new import video. All right, I'll use this one first. So I'll set the start there and then set the end there. Okay, cool. Okay, for this video, I'm just gonna be editing Heesung and Sungoon because number one, that's my bias and my wrecker. And two, I got the most footage of them at the concert. Like, even though everyone was obviously incredible, they were definitely the ones who were stealing my attention. So, so I'm gonna have the first half of the audio be Heesung and then the second half, Sungoon. So we'll go new, import video. We'll do this one. Ooh, this is giving like scale in panning, but that was just my camera work. Like, okay, editing over time. Time. Okay, I really can't tell if this is on beat like literally at all. Import video. Yeah, this this moment actually um almost killed me. I almost died. I was screaming my head off that entire concert. Obviously, I lost my voice, but I lose my voice after every single concert. Like literally after sound check, no voice at all. I'm gonna be using the same clip for the next beat because the beat before is like super short. So I want to use this video twice. How does he how does he just get away with being this fine? Like I'm gonna okay, I don't even care. It's the way I literally don't care. I don't care. I miss him so much. Import another one. This, well, yes. That's my second favorite in Hypen song ever. My favorite one ever. I feel like some people might know this. Y'all, this is my favorite Hypen song. One in a billion. Yeah. Okay, GPS. I don't know if my concert video of me screaming that song was any indication, but. I definitely was very, very happy when that song came on. Why is this off beat? I'll die, okay. Just to give you a sense of our timeline, this is the day of the concert and it's currently noon. So we're gonna get to the venue at like, 34 minutes, 34 minutes. I don't know if we're eating beforehand though. It's already so crowded there. Like people have been there since probably last night. Yeah, 6 a.m. Or even, I know people who showed up last night. Yeah, I don't know if they're honoring those lines, but none of my business. It's said in the email that they were honoring. We're VIP two, we have sound check, but we're in section 102, row nine. So we're pretty, we're pretty close. The arena is like, you also had to go yesterday or Wednesday to get a wristband. <gasps> Sweet Venom, Sweet Venom. Sorry, it was the English version, I had to skip it. Oh yeah, no. <laughs> This bitch is one in a billion. No, 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 not good on talker, you're everything. They are one in a tunnel with some take over pay. Now we're using Criminal Love, he sung. And then this last one will be Let Me In 20 Cube, he sung, of course. I gotta center that correctly. And then now this is the sung -un part. I'll also use a clip of sung -un and Let Me In. His arm, his arm. Oh, I can't even crop that correctly, bruh. I'll do like that, cause you need to see his arm, but like I don't wanna cut off like all of his head. And then I'm gonna use this clip of him flexing, like that's actually kind of insane. I did not have a solidified bias record going into the concert. Leaving the concert, he definitely fulfilled that role. I literally missed a beat okay it's fine it's fine i'll just replace this clip out of all the fan cams i posted there was one in particular that went viral compared to the others and it was sung during one in a billion oh my god if you want to watch the full version go to my tiktok but how do I oh, the head lift the head shake ah! and then obviously i have to use this part what was he doing with all that tongue okay so the base is made and finalized i think now we will go in it with the velocity i'm gonna start with this last clip because it seems pretty easy to put velocity on it not reading all of that Sorry. Nav did send me a QR code for the velocity. Should I just use that? All right, I just saved that. I can't give it out for free though. The cure is how did you be put fit? That might have been too fast for this video. I think I need to slow it down a bit. Okay, yeah. And then create. Wait, I never oh I never did my subscription. I need to make sure my subscription is actually active. Okay, give me a second. Guys, 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 guys we're you'll here. You'll never believe you'll never believe where we are. Guys, we're in. Light sticks, wait. 
VIP. Yo, VIP. VIP tag. Hey. So here's my light stick. I'm gonna tag all the people who helped create this light stick, and you guys can go buy from them. I made these. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet. Where to talk at though? Where to talk at? Where to talk at? Yup. <laughs> Wait, guys, we just got freebies from the nicest girl. This is their info. Thank you so much. This is the bracelet. It came with like a Jake photo card. It's so cute. Oh, here's the VIP two wristband, by the way. Sound check is seated, so we don't have to wait in a line or anything. Look at us. <laughs> this nice lady gave us chalk. Chalk. <laughs> And that's what I wrote. I did that, and May did that. You're welcome. Make it look like it is outside. Yes, we will do that. Okay, guys, I did this too for Jungwon. Slay. All right, guys, it's about to be two. The line starts at like three. I've already met two people who recognize me from online, guys. One of them gave me freebies and she was so nice and then some really really nice girl named denise just came up to me and she was like i've been watching you since the charlie undercover and i was like you're a real one so yeah i think we're just gonna wander for another hour i had to wait for video star to respond to me to tell me like how to use the code they gave me for the free pro subscription but we got the code working so now i can finally use the velocity yes off beat perfect kick to the code like, okay. I'm gonna put in Nav's QR code again and then make it a little bit slower. Not me just watching this on loop. Okay, I think that looks good. Create. Okay, period. Everyone say thank you, Nav. That's crazy. And then she told me about the better mixer. Yes, okay, it's right here. So we'll do the first clip, velocity, Nav QR code. With all of these, I'm just gonna need to make it a little bit slower just because of like, that's the pacing of the videos that I took. And then here, better mixer. Try to go below the belt, do my team. That was good. Okay, next clip. I personally don't consider this to be cheating because like I still have to, you know, mess around with it and I still have to, to some extent, like understand how this works. Like I know that when I'm dragging it lower, I'm making it slower. When I drag it back, I'm like moving the keyframe. If I drag it up, then I'm making it faster. Like all that stuff. Better mixture, create. Oh, that's Bambi right there. Oh my God. Oh, I want to go back to the concert so bad, guys. It was so fun. This is insane. Okay, since this clip is so short, I don't think I need this like ending part. I think, should I get rid of this point? It's so short, you can barely tell, but I think it looks good. You guys gotta let me know in the comments if you edit on Video Star, do you use a QR code to do your velocity? And if you do, is it like your own preset or is it someone else's QR code that you found? Or do you just start from scratch with each clip? Cause I know when I'm doing Twixter on After Effects, I don't have a Twixter preset saved like at all. If I'm starting a new velocity edit, I always just do it real quick. I don't know why. Maybe I'm always changing it up. But then as I keep making the edit, I'll just copy those keyframes and paste it to my other clips. But it only works on some clips that's the thing about velocity like different settings are gonna look good on different clips so you're always gonna have to tweak it this one can definitely be a little faster i think this one's gonna look absurd like absurdly good Bruh! and i was right and then we have desi shakuna hearing that song live oh my god the person that i became is not something that i'm proud of <laughs> Okay, two more clips of his song and then we get to Sangun. I'm having fun with this, if I'm being honest. This diva, he's such a diva. Period, okay. And then we have the let me him body roll. I'm excited to see how this is gonna look with velocity. <laughs> Who else screamed? That's so good, okay. And now let's get to Hoon's part. So I'll push that a little bit and then go a little down. He literally looks not real. He's actually a vampire. The way he's like a real vampire cosplaying as a fake vampire in this boy group, like. We know what you are. Wow really good i need to like text nav right now nav is currently touching grass which i should definitely do more of so it's the way he's so fine for no reason like pissing me off okay ah! and then same for the next clip it's the flexing clip hard needs to close the gyms immediately because why are his arms getting so big and the same applies to he sung don't even get me started on human and kai that what wow wow i don't think i'm actually ready to see how this is gonna look Okay, how is that a real
real video I took with my phone. I'm crying. Oh, also, I forgot to say, I filmed all these videos on the iPhone 15 Pro, not Pro. I actually have no idea. This is the phone. This is the phone. Oh, why am I blushing? Okay. Okay, let's wash this base. Like it is just off B. Can I like split C? I could have sworn it was on B when I was adding the little hearts on TikTok, but it's fine. I'm here with Emily. We oh, share a mutual. Oh, oh, I guess we're not pissing. I just saw one of my Twitter oofs, but I was too scared to say something because I'm I feel like I'm really yeah. awkward. Hey guys, so we're in line. <laughs> we are in line. They actually UBS has it organized very, very good. Okay. Okay. This is the VIP two line, so we're seated for sound check and for the show. And then I'll show you the VIP one line. Here it is. It's across from us. I know these people have been waiting forever. That's oomph right there. Hi oomph. Yeah. So we're just gonna chill and wait. It's we're almost just, three. I was literally just taking selfies and I called it a day. Well, I need to take while. some. <laughs> Guys, we just got the cutest freebies ever. They're like little Pokemon cards. Look. Mm -hmm. Fourth oh. gen leader. Let's read his songs. Okay. Ace. Bambi boy. The picture. This picture of Sungu actually sends me. Oh, did you all get the same one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Period. I got the lucky draw. Huning spotted in the wild. Huning. Okay, guys, you saw May's Nikki flag. Salute. Yay. Yeah. All right, y'all, it's 419, bruh. It's literally 419, and we're still waiting on this line. Like, what? My final grade came in. Let's see if my <gasps> We're checking grades right now online. You ate. She ate. <gasps> I still packed the class. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot this. I forgot this. I forgot this. I forgot this. <laughs> and who do we have to thank? Lee Song. Lee Song. Lee Song, thank you, thank you. <laughs> to quickly add an effect to the whole clip, set it up and hit quick FX. I don't know exactly what I'm looking for. No, these are all the ones that you use when you're like making video star music videos when you're like 12 years old. I don't think this is what I'm looking for actually. You know what? I'm gonna try some scale panning first. Multi-layer, load your last setup. Edit keyframes. There we go. So that's a keyframe there. And then at the end, I'll have it scaled forward like that. Okay, so then back and then does it keep it like that? What about for the brightness though? If I put it like that, will it like add a keyframe and then I go to the end and make it low? Okay, I still have to work on that, but I was able to add the scale panning keyframe. So I'll do that for the rest of the clips. Multi-layer, edit keyframes. I'm gonna have it start a little zoomed in and then zoom out, okay? It's like very subtle because it's a short clip. Back, create, edit keyframes. This one's gonna be zooming in, so it'll end like this. Back, create. Oh, I'm a pro. I'm a pro at this point. New, multi-layer, de, click, de, edit keyframes, zoom in, and zoom out, back, create. Beautiful. And I don't really add any graphs when I do my panning on After Effects, so that is staying consistent. Oh my God, this one, okay. We'll have it zoom in, bruh. And then last clip, we'll have it start zoomed in. Yeah, and this one can zoom out a decent amount because it's pretty long. Trying to go below the belt, mm, to my damn perfect king to the cut. Okay, we're literally inside the venue. We're walking to our seats now. Invite me. Why am I crying, guys? I'm fucking crying. Oh, wait, what? Guys, what the we're so wait, wait. We're so fucking close. Oh, so... <laughs> guys, we're this is not zoomed in right now. I and and we're so close. Okay, guys, we're looking at merch now, and like we really, really want this hoodie. Tell me why it's a hundred dollars. Why is it a hundred dollars? Tell me why it's a hundred dollars. Why is it a hundred dollars? Why is it a hundred dollars for some clothing? You know, I could get that on Temu for five dollars. <laughs> and are we still gonna buy it? Yeah. <laughs> so I like the hat too. Oh, I also want to buy an album, which like kind of seems dumb, but like I'm here, so might as well. I'm probably gonna get Dark Blood and Orange Blood engine version, but we have to see about this line. It's about to be five o'clock soon, and five checks, five check, sound check starts at five thirty. So, guys, I literally was crying. I literally was crying. I just don't know what to do with myself. 
Hi YouTube, subscribe to Lauren and I will give you his increment hyphen. Nav says hi everyone, everyone say thank you Nav for the velo. Okay, I'm gonna try to go about adding like the blurs between each clip the same way I did the scaling cause I know I'm gonna need to edit the keyframes. Where are the effects though? Layout, can I search? There we go, maybe this is what I was looking for. Directional, yeah. blur. Motion blur is what I'm most familiar with so we'll look at that. Oh, that's basically what I was looking for. Yeah, it's like directional blur. Edit keyframes. How do I do it for the effect though? Layout effect not selected. Yes, it was selected though. Pre-mask blur? Which one is better? Which one do we like more? Yeah, this one is probably better, right? Color? Oh, there we go. So we'll keyframe it at zero towards the end. Blurry. Do I need to do custom? Yeah, I do need to do custom. Okay. Oh, spline bezier. Yeah, that's what I need. Simple and painless enough. And now I just need to do that for every single clip. Please. So we go layout, motion blur, pre-mask blur, edit keyframes, color, start it out like that. And then soon it'll be clear, custom, go like that. Then go to the end and do that same thing. In graph. Is it too fast? WAY TOO FAST! OH MY GOD! Ooh, that was a jump scare. Yeah, we. I just made the custom graphs way too fast. You know, at least I have it figured out. At least I know enough that I can go back and fix my mistakes, because if it were a couple months ago, a couple years ago, I would have just been like, oh! <laughs> I guess that's what the edit looks like now. We're gonna have to see it all together to see if that's an upgrade. I'm not loving it, but now I know what to do differently for the rest of the edit. So for this one, I think we're gonna switch it up, guys. I don't, th I don't think you're ready for this. We're gonna do a vertical blur instead of horizontal. Pre-mask blur, go vertical, edit keyframes, have it start like that, and then go back to zero, and then custom graph, not too fast, not too slow, and then we'll set it again here, and then at the end, doop, doop. Ooh! Below the bell. Mm. Okay, my camera's about to die. So I'm gonna add the rest of the blurs off camera and then I'll show you guys what that looks like. VIP2 merch reveal. So first, this cute little fate bracelet, we'll be putting it on. <gasps> what is this? It's like a little coffin. Oh, that's cute. Wait, this Wait, is so cute. This up? Did we? <laughs> Swim it up! y'all i'm back a little bit later and so i added all my blurs i added some stuff with saturation whatever but i also finally allowed myself to experiment more with qr codes and guys why am i literally loving this like i am not stressed out at all making this like i'm having fun okay with what you're about to watch i have all my blurs and i added two qr codes for a ghost effect this one right here is from this youtube channel which i will put right here it's so awesome and then the second one on this clip is from nav of course here is the edit so far Kind of 
oh my god obviously we have mad edits and nav to thank for how amazing those qr codes look and i'm definitely going to be using more of nav's qr codes for the coloring and the flicker and the pan and stuff if you're wondering on how to add qr codes oh my god the video start tutorial hey new multi-layer and then you go here and then you just click the last layer you were working with and then you just keep adding stuff onto there video star users listening to me explain this right now are probably like we know we've known for years you're the only person who didn't know okay but right now i'm gonna add a glitch qr code that of course nav sent me it literally looks so good let me see if there are any other clips that should use glitch i think it would look good on this clip here get the most recent one qr code period oh my god i'm literally obsessed okay okay guys it's dinner time i gotta go again but when i come back we'll do the glows <laughs> Right, guys dinner was consumed let's get back to this nav sent me the qr code for the glow so we're gonna try to do that she does some cool layering with it though so we'll see if i'll need to do that for optimal brightness okay yeah she does it with three layers i think i might do it with two actually i think the third one did look good hold on oh okay i think that looks really good for this clip because it's longer but i might have to change it to just two layers for the rest of the clip so we'll see replace content layer i think that's a good layer of brightness so then we'll just clear the third layer I'm literally obsessed. And then for this like really, really short clip, I'll probably just do one layer of the flash. With how comfortable I'm becoming with Video Star, y'all better be on the lookout for a Video Star undercover. Um, but hey, I didn't say that. Like this might be my most successful Video Star experience thus far. Oh, that looks so good. The only thing that would make this better genuinely is if it was on beat. So since a lot of these clips are shorter, I'm just doing the two layers for the flash. And I think that looks really good. Okay, I'm gonna finish adding all the flashes and I'll see you guys in a minute.
y'all i did all the flashes so this is what it's looking like perfect kink to the cone okay and the last step is just merging everything together and then adding the flicker pan and coloring i know i go here and merge scenes i don't know if it merges everything set start set end and then we will merge you can now preview the merge and undo it or save it all right first let's add the panning as i mentioned all of these are nav's qr codes okay preview done then we'll go in again this isn't a multi-layer qr code so maybe re-effect oh here we go oh there we go yay quick effects oh my god the flicker's there period go stream flicker by and hyphen Okay, and then I think the last thing is the coloring. Bring everything together. I don't know if I'll be able to do this on multi-layer question mark. Let's hope. Okay, it said it's not a multi-layer QR code. Well, I'll try the re-effect thing again then. This isn't an effect here. <laughs> well, then what is it? Re-effect, transform, mix, maybe? Mix? No, that's not. Damn, this is like the last step. Transform? Did it work? Oh, it worked. Okay, she sent me two different colorings though, so we'll see which one looks better with these clips. Damn, this looks really good. Then there's this one. Ooh, yeah, I think I like this one. I'm gonna put the intensity a little bit less. Okay, and then create. This may take a while. I can wait, I have the time. Ah, okay, okay. The edit is ready to be saved and watched and loved and admired. All right, guys, let's watch. <laughs> Wow, that was not half bad. I really, really liked that. I mean, obviously all of Nav's QR codes carried and the one ghost effect I used from the tutorial channel, but what I did a good job at was finding the clips and putting them together, I guess, which I also got help for. So listen, at the end of the day, I'm just glad that I can still edit despite not having my computer at this very moment. So I'm glad I can give you guys something. To say our good place for you. I honestly cannot believe that it's already the last show tonight. As you can tell, I'm not at the concert anymore. <laughs>
my phone was on like six percent for the last couple of songs so really had to preserve my battery but i think you can tell from the screams that was the best time of my life um post-concert depression is real like i'm sad but i'm so happy and fulfilled and like best experience of my life but like that's sad like i miss them what like i miss them already like he's on come home they were literally so amazing the way they're in sync the way they're a visual group a dance group a singing group like my favorite and hyping song of all time is one in a billion tell me why they sound checked it tell me why they sound checked it like i heard that song twice in one night they knew i was going there tame dash was so good one and only with the pikachus attention please shout out i'm gonna i'm gonna keep it at that wait shakon oh guys it's hard out here oh wait and i'm gonna give you a really quick freebie haul because it's midnight and i'm really really tired i actually had an extra ticket and i ended up selling it to this very nice girl named crystal so for me my cousin she showed up with freebies and they're a photo card she literally gave us official photo cards for freebies like what love you crystal really hope to see you again okay sorry the lighting's bad i spread it on my bed so this was the very last freebie i got it says sweet venom which is very fitting because i'm dressed as he sung sweet venom then this one which is absolutely insane and then this one it literally comes with the keychain too like what and then these are like some of my favorites these are so so cute and creative and y'all can check out her twitter then this one and hype and bracelet that i was literally wearing but i took it off to show you again and then i got a freebie of layla this person gave me so many he's so freebies oh my god and then lastly it's this one it's a cute little gummy bear chain and three little pcs these are from the girl that i showed in the video i'm gonna end this vlog off by saying thank you guys so much for viewing the vlog i guess and also just a shout out to like every single engine that was at the concert tonight it was just such like a safe and fun environment like the vibes and energy and environment were just right do you get what i mean like everyone was so sweet everyone was dressed insane and like throwing out compliments left and right it was just it was such a safe space not to mention i met 14 of you guys 14 14 people who know me from tiktok youtube whatever it is i kept count because that obviously doesn't happen to me every day and it was really really special to me but y'all you know who you are hyped me up made me feel like so special like i don't know what i did to deserve that but genuinely it was so so nice and it made the experience like even better like i didn't know the experience could be any better than seeing it hyphen like seeing my mans this one girl specifically said oh my god i used to like love your videos and your edits and like you were the reason that i made an editing account and like used to edit you were the reason i started an editing account i know a lot of people like also say that online but to have someone say that to my face was like <gasps> all right i love you guys so so much thank you guys so so much for watching i hope you all enjoyed have a great day or night wherever you are and bye